In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up saved replies and auto replies on Etsy so that you can respond to your customers quickly and save yourself time and effort. This is really easy to do on Etsy, so let's get started. First, we'll be in our dashboard in Etsy in our shop dashboard. We'll go over to the left menu, find messages, and click on that to navigate to the messages area. Here in messages, we have a lot of different options. We can start composing or we can turn on our auto reply first. I highly recommend you do this so that your customers get an auto reply no matter where you are in the world. It is really nice for them to at least get a reply and know that you will be checking back in with them soon. So you can click on auto reply, a pop-up comes up for the auto reply settings. Click the little toggle switch at the top to turn it on and then create your auto reply message. It can be something really simple, just a thank you and I will be contacting you shortly. Then at the bottom, you'll have a drop down where you can set the auto reply timing. This is just when the auto reply message will go out to the customer that's contacted you. There's different options from one hour up to a couple days. Of course, you're gonna wanna do it as quickly as possible, especially within one day, just because of how the Etsy customer service works now and getting the star seller badge. You want your customers to get a response no matter what within 24 hours. So definitely pick one of the top ones. I always like to do it within an hour so that they're getting a response as quick as possible. Now let's look at how to set up a saved reply. Click compose in the top corner, a new pop-up comes up and you can enter all of the information here. You can also save a ton of time setting these up by using the ones that Etsy already has ready for you. You can see a couple of these underneath the message area where it says frequently used save replies. You can click on these and it'll automatically fill in those or you can click the button down below that says all saved replies. That brings up another pop-up that shows some of the most frequently used replies by Etsy sellers to their customers. So things like custom orders, downloads, personalizations, reviews, shipping, all of that. So these are the really common ones and you can use these to just fill in your saved replies and save a ton of time. You can click on the little edit button on one of them and then edit the title, the message, and the category for yourself so that you can have this saved reply automatically put into your system. You can edit the message and add anything you want, like custom codes for discounts to give your customers so that they are really happy with the customer service that you're providing. You can add whatever you want here. Then you save it to a category so that it is saved under all of these saved replies along with the ones that Etsy has automatically. When you're happy with it, you click save, which on my screen, it was really messed up. So it was over toward the left side, but it should be underneath the all of the saved replies. Click save and that will save the message so that you can use it as a saved reply. To create a new one from scratch, you go up to add new, then go down to saved reply, click that and a add new saved reply pop-up will come up where you can enter everything from scratch. So you'll give it a title, a message and a category, just like the automatic saved reply that you edited. It's the same process here to create a saved reply from scratch. You can also create a new category. So when you select the category dropdown, you can go up and click on create new category, which will give you a space to type in a new category. So you can add thank yous or whatever here and then click save. Then you will have a new category show up at the bottom that you can save other replies to. That's how you create and save saved replies, but let's look at how this works in practice. So you'll be sending these to customers. So let's click on a customer message from a sale that I had. So here you can see when you go to type a reply, a lot of the frequently used saved replies are down here at the bottom. You can just click on any of these and the saved reply will automatically fill in. This saves you a ton of time so you don't have to copy and repeat yourself over and over and over again. So you can just click on these and send thank you coupons or give them digital download instructions. Lots of things that customers will ask you over and over again. You just click the button and then it fills in. Then you click send and you're done. You can do this with your frequently used or any saved reply that you've created. To do that, you just click the all saved replies and you'll go back to that saved replies form and you'll see all of the different options that you have. This also works with your saved replies. So you can go down here to where it says all saved replies, click on that, and the pop-up comes up again. So let's say you wanna send them the digital download instructions, you would click on that, and it fills in automatically the message that you have to send them for digital download instructions. Then you go down to the button and click send and you are done. You can do this with any of the saved replies. It will automatically create all these frequently used saved replies that are the ones that 
you send most often to customers. So you can definitely rely on this for most of your communications. But remember that all your saved replies are here. This saves a ton of time. So I highly recommend you set up your saved replies. It will be so great for you to respond to customers faster. And it's also something that is really important if you want to get that star seller badge, which is about having a good track record with customer experience. So you're gonna want five star reviews, shipped orders on times, and replied to any messages they received quickly. So this is one way that you can do it and speed up your customer service and get that star seller badge. I hope this was helpful and helps you create a ton of income selling on Etsy.